So what kind of meat? What is the cut of this meat? Esto, this is a called entraña in Argentina. Mm -hmm. this, this is a short skirt. The short skirt. Okay. It's so incredible that people don't usually don't don't use it much. So is what is the trick or the secret to making it so tender? Uh, actually, buy a good meat uh, and pay some dollar more. Go to farmers market. Uh -huh. The we don't macerate the meat. We just put a uh, salt and nothing more. And the salt is adding at the end when it's cooked. Oh, really? Yes. Okay. Not at the start. What that is the way, reason for that? The salt uh, you're saying, right? Well, actually, the, the salt usually make the meat uh, sometimes uh, lost the uh, lost the humidity mm -hmm. since the with the salt everything coming dry. It dries the salt it out. Suck. Yep. This is why we put it at the end. All right, all right, and now talk to me about the sausage. These are the the, the sausages. I know we have any package. Mm -hmm. uh, Sergio, that is with us tonight, mm -hmm. he made a special recipe that Argentinian theoretically uh, the way that we do the, the the way that we do it is mixing uh, thirty percent of cow meat mm -hmm. and the rest will be pork. That way, it's a different type of flavor. It's not that only pork in the. So in thirty percent beef and and yes. seventy percent pork, huh? That's the tradition. So this is you call this a chorizo? We call the chorizo criollo. Criollo. Yes. Okay. And we are serving this in two different type of bread. Okay. One is a focaccia, and uh -huh. one is the typical. This is this is what we call choripan. Choripan. We make a sandwich with the chorizo. Gotcha. Pan meaning uh, bread in Spanish. Exactly. Okay. Fantastic. So there's the trays ready to go over to the where the guests are. So absolutely wonderful here.